If you guys are in need of coins for any reason, make sure to check out CheapMaddenCoins.com. Use code Mike at checkout for 10% off. Why, hello everybody. Welcome to uh, my official room tour. Come on in, come on in. I don't, I don't want to show much uh, at first. We're just going to start out uh, with, this, with this corner right here. Now, you might need to get a little close up here, okay? That's Kobe Bean Bryant. This is the first poster of the room. I thought it looked cool on Amazon. Honestly, that's why I got it. Um, it's in an awkward spot. No one really comes over here. I have a chair. Um, I have a hammer. I bought a hammer, all right? That's when you know you're a grown up and you're an adult when you buy hammers, okay? Uh, a bunch of boxes right there. This is like the most boring part of my room. So I wanna start out with that and just get it out the way, okay? We're gonna migrate this way. All right, we're gonna migrate this way. This is my bed. Um, it's kind of shitty. I'm not gonna lie to you. When I lie down, okay, this part is fantastic. This part is great. But if I migrate to this area, I'm pretty much sitting on a camel's back, okay? We're talking massive hump all the way on this bed. It's not great. Um, I get a lot of questions. You guys ask me, you're like, Mike, what are these lights? Well, I'm gonna tell you right now. This is a light strip held up by duct tape. You guys, I I've held up this light strip by duct tape so many times because the adhesive on the back continues to wear out. It continues to wear out. Uh, this is a Philips Hue light strip. They're super overpriced. You could probably find something similar to it on Amazon for a lot less. Um, but I got it because I saw it like on tech YouTube channels and I figured, why the heck not? Uh, Zoom in on that right there, that is a, actually like a, a mini panorama of the first game back in Los Angeles for the Rams. It actually sold, I want to say it sold out, which is crazy because the Coliseum holds like over 100,000 people, which is, I mean, I think uh, the Dallas Cowboys Stadium is one of the only stadiums that's close to that. So the fact that there was that many people there is kind of insane. LA is kind of a fair weather town when it comes to sports, but Either way, I really like that, so I wanted to buy it. I got it on Amazon. Uh, this right here, if we have any Game of Thrones fans, this is one of my most prized possessions, okay? It's a picture of Daenerys Targaryen on top of one of her dragons. Now, yes, that is kind of a spoiler that she has dragons, but like, let's be real, you guys know Game of Thrones has dragons. I'm not gonna say anything else that happens, but that is uh, kind of like a mural or a painting or a poster or something, a canvas, that's probably a better word, a canvas. Um, yeah, now this down here, okay, I have a story. This is the uh, Lifex tile something. Pretty much it, it lights stuff up. You can put it on the wall. It's really cool. Um, you probably have to have a 167 IQ to set it up. It is extremely difficult to set up. It is so difficult that I'm literally going to return it uh, because I can't get it. I, I'm, I'm only a YouTuber. Uh, I don't have that type of education level. Um, that is something that I bought on Amazon for like $30. If you push it, um, it will fall over. So don't push it. It's it's very cheap and not good. This is my couch. Uh, this is a couch that you guys have seen a lot on videos. Um, I'll be honest with you, it's not great. Uh, it's just a couch, it's there. Uh, if you sit down on it, at least for people the size of, of me and Will, you don't really fit. Um, so I don't exactly know what this part is for, other than to just make it an L-shaped couch. So there's that, you're standing on a rug. I don't really know why I'm putting out every single inanimate object, but I am. Uh, let's actually go to this side right here. This is something that's pretty cool. I actually got this a while ago. Um, I don't, is it a flag? I'm not exactly sure what it is, uh, but it shows that the Lakers were in Minneapolis starting 1948. They moved to LA in 1967. They got the brand new logo in 2001, and that is the Lake Show. So yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. We also have this bad boy. This is a poster of Kobe Bryant when he won his fifth championship. Now, for any basketball connoisseurs out there, you guys know that this is the exact same pose that Michael Jordan did, winning his fifth, sixth championship. I'm not sure, one of them. He has six. Uh, I got a one in 16% six, chance of getting it right. Did I, is that the percentage? Did I get it right? Check, can I get a math check? Uh, we'll see. Um, but yeah, so that's the pose that he's doing. I thought this was a pretty sick, pretty iconic poster, so I ended up copying. Um, those are two systems that are 
extremely different. One is a new age system that is garbage. It's trash. It, I, I might actually throw it in the trash. It's the Xbox One. Just don't ever get it. The other one is the Xbox 360, which is probably the greatest console ever created. Just plain and simple. So yeah, I'm really not using either of them. I probably, I probably should start using them. Behind you is a television that I've had for God knows how long. I got it when I was working at Best Buy. It's a plasma, and I wanted the really, the really high hertz or whatever. And I got it for pretty cheap, like 400 bucks. I think it was normally like 800. Best Buy, you get a bunch off with the employee discount. Um, so yeah, we we pretty much covered almost everything in the room so far, except for the best part, which is I'm, we're gonna turn around, okay? I'm gonna turn this on, so maybe there's better lighting. This is gonna get bright, okay? Close your eyes. Okay, there it is. It is very bright. Uh, we made everything a lot brighter. I said that word three times. We're gonna stop, just go to the next part. Okay, so this is my chair. This chair, if you go on DX Racer's website, is literally built for someone who is six foot eight, 350 pounds. I'm a big guy. I won't deny that. Am I six foot eight, 350 pounds? Not quite, not there. Um, I'm about, you know what? There's no point in getting into that. I'm not that big. So when I sit in it, Okay, I can literally sit crisscross, Indian style. I don't know if that's racist, I don't think it is. Uh, I can sit like this, which is extremely comfortable. And I'm six foot five, so I'm not a small guy. I'm not slight in figure, okay? This is a great chair, absolutely love it. Extremely overpriced, wouldn't recommend. Yeah, so here is my desk. This is where I have everything right now. Now, I moved a bunch of this around, so I'll kind of try to explain it here for you. Let's start out on the far left. This is like, this is like my editing station. So when I'm done recording videos, I will come here. I have my iMac. I have this extra monitor that I, honestly, I use it to have iTunes open to pull up my music. It's kind of embarrassing that I literally use a singular monitor only for iTunes, but you know, first world problems. I don't think that applies, but I'm just gonna say it. So. We have our Razer keyboard, Razer mouse pad, Razer mouse. I know this is the Death Adder. I think that's what it's called. Um, I want to say this is like chroma key, something like that. If you go on Best Buy's website, or you just go on Razer's website, just look at the ones that are similar to that. That's 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 pretty much pretty much what it is. Um, like I said, this is my iMac. I edit on Mac. I use Final Cut Pro 10. Um, I get a lot of people that ask me that. I love I, I love Apple's editing software. I think they're pretty much the best. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all I got for the editing station and this side of things. Now we're gonna move to like the gaming portion, which is this, I guess gaming slash recording. So this camera that I'm using right now um, is a Sony A6272, 5200, one of those three. I'm not exactly sure. I, actually, I could probably just look at it. Uh, 6500, almost got it. Uh, it's a Sony A6500 and it normally sits right here and I normally sit right here when I record. This is the monitor that I used to record on. I have my PlayStation 4 hooked up to it and my brand new gaming PC, which you guys see down there. If any of you guys watch my live streams, I do play Fortnite a lot. That is normally what I stream. That's what's pulled up right now. Um, I have this microphone. I really like the way it's set up. I've been able to get my audio actually pretty good. It's gonna sound like ass in this video, um, but that's because I'm not using that. I'm using the regular, uh, I don't know, audio recording thing, microphone. There it is, that's the word. Uh, I'm using the regular microphone on the camera and not this one. So, uh, this is a blue Yeti. Why is it black when it's called blue? I don't know, but there it is. It's a blue Yeti. Um, it's really good. It's, I don't think it's overpriced. It's like 150 and I, I have seen people buy $800 mics and they sound the exact same as this. A lot of it has to do with what you do in post. Um, this is a shitty keyboard and mouse. Literally one that came with a computer, so I'm not even gonna talk about that. Um, this monitor is an Asus, mm, I can't remember what it's called. Asus something, it's a bunch of letters and numbers. Uh, it's pretty much one used for gaming, so if you just type in ASUS Gaming Monitor, uh, it's a 24 inch, you'll probably know exactly which one it is. Um, what else do I have to show? I don't think much, other than these, which these are most definitely not overpriced. I feel like I had to show them. I had to let you guys know that I have them. 
and they are in here, fully charged, okay? You have to understand that if you have AirPods, you need to let people know that you have them. That's just the bottom line. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Uh, I mean, the area behind you really isn't, like, anything. It's just, like, nothingness. And I was gonna put some stuff up, but I was like, you know what? <laughs> F it. I I'm just gonna record this video. So, I really don't know exactly what I'm talking about at this point. I'm, I'm probably just gonna wrap it up. Uh, that is my room. Uh, actually, one, 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 one more thing. Up here, look at that, okay? People constantly ask me how I get my room to be a certain color. These are Philips Hue light bulbs, okay? Philips Hue light bulb, Philips Hue light bulb, Philips Hue light bulb, and behind the couch is a Philips Hue light bulb, okay? That is how I get my room to be a certain color. That is why this looks the way it is. I can change the color, I can make it different, I can make it white, green. I don't need to go all through the colors for you, you probably, probably understand that. Um, that's a bathroom. Not really much to show there other than a bathroom, so I'm not gonna bother. Is this video 10 minutes? I doubt it. And you know what? It is? It's 11. It's 11 minutes? Okay, all right, guys. If the video's over 10 minutes, mission accomplished. If it's not, mission failed. We'll get them next time. Okay, guys, so that's, that's pretty much the video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this room tour, and if you want other room tours like Wheels and Vix, Definitely let them know on their channel. Okay, so like I said, that's pretty much it for the video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure to drop a like down below. Subscribe if you are new. And guys, I will hit you. I might hit you. Jesus Christ, I'm not gonna assault you. I will see you in my next upload. Peace! <laughs>